Man, come up here. I dare you. Damn! I got health, bitch. Yeah! Spinning strikes, baby! No! This is why we level health, guys. This is why we le <laughs> You can't explain it. No, I can't. Mm -hmm. Not to him. <laughs> Damn. That was crazy. Or, Damn. Not, not, not like that, but... <laughs> not general, like that. Like, hey, but especially <laughs> to someone like him. Hey, if I told you Gideon is already dead, would you be surprised? No, he's trash. <laughs> and, you, and you need help. So I should probably explain to you guys what this run is. But what if I just don't? We only upgrade health. Boom. And then y'all might be thinking, only upgrading health? Ain't that just an easier version of the level one run? But no, it's not. Calm down, you dog neighbor! Alright. <clears throat> I had recently discovered that the DLC bosses will be scaled, even if it's your first time there, depending on what journey you are. So if I went in there on my primary character... Sorry, bro. If I went in there on my primary character, like I normally would... Okay, this guy's gonna be helpful eventually. Um... You know, I would have to um, deal with new game plus two bosses, right? Or whatever it is. New game plus three? I don't know. I think it's plus two, technically. Journey three is plus two. The point is, if I want to experience the true DLC, you know, new game journey one DLC... All I have to do is simply make another character, right? So I'm going to use this character as a challenge run. But the true final boss of this challenge run is going to be Moog because that's the place where you unlock the DLC. All right. Wow, this guy is a joke. Well, those will happen from time to time. And I already meet the requirements. All right, time to leave here and never return. A few moments later. We're gonna have a really ridiculous health bar by the end of this. And we start it, we, we pick the Vagabond because it has the highest uh, starting level of 15. So already we're going to have the, a very high health and it makes for a fun run as well just because the Vagabond gets good strength, dex, and endurance compared to a wretch. So I can use more things that I wouldn't have been able to use on a level 1 run, a true level 1 run. Hey guys, don't mind me. Just casually living life, you know? Just casually going to my favorite place. Because none of these guys actually care about me, right? Let's see. Will they send a second poison cloud at me? Because otherwise I could do this in one go. Alright, we're good. We're good. Let's see if I can do this in one go then. Get half number one. And then let's go ahead and uh, put that away. And we'll, we'll drop down on them. Alright, now I just gotta run. Straight over here. Don't mind me, Mr. Thunder. I lied. I need the torch. Oh my god. Huh. <laughs> this dude still one-shots you at 15 health? 
That's crazy. That's a powerful rat right there. The powerful rat named Charles Entertainment Cheese. The paraplegic life ain't for him, man. He used to be big and bad. I know he wants to perish. Don't make me get another bleed. Don't make me get another bleed, man. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you. My finger's going numb. It's been five minutes. Take my money. 50 bears, 50 bears. Oh, never mind. It was cap. It's actually 74 bands. But we'll go level 30. Since it's the only thing I'll be leveling up anyway. Alright. Now let me go talk to my merchants now. Hey, bro. She she dead as fuck. I'm not gonna lie to you. I already told you that. But, like, she's, like, she's like really dead as fuck. Alright, anyways. Um... Do -do 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 How you been, man? How you been, man? And then we go over here. All right, I'll take a memory stone. I'll take a finger seal. I'll take a dagger. I might as well ride this fucking elevator down because I'm gonna need it later. Man, you motherfucking clowns. About to put Marcus ass in the ground and got Rick too. Then I'm gonna end this recording and go tie my shoes, shoot some fucking hoops in the backyard two for two from the free throw line. Man, I'm just doing time in jail after all my fucking crimes I committed back in 83. Back in 83. I don't even know what I'm trying to fucking see, but I'm trying to win this game again for the DLC. Hey, hey, hey oh my God, keep that in. Keep that in, editor. <clears throat> I'm the editor. But I'm telling the editor to keep that in, even though it's me in the future. Hey, mute whatever I was saying. Freestyle on the way down, elevator music on the way up. Man, come up here. I dare you. Damn. I got health, bitch. Yeah, spinning strikes, baby. You know, my health bar is just so juicy now. I mean, what's he really going to do? I'm going to make him come at me. Swing first, boy. Dude, that's so annoying when he does that shit. Ah! Why did I pause the game? Okay. Okay. I'm not even gonna heal, bro. Bitch. Now that's what prep time can do for you. This ain't no hitless run, baby. I can do whatever the fuck I want. And we know exactly where these levels are going, baby. Well. That's spinning strikes for you. No, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> Go 
ahead, do it again, blood. Why is he not doing the jump attack right now? That's actually annoying. <laughs> he didn't do the, he didn't want to do the jump attack, I guess. No. This is why we level health, guys. This is why we le <laughs> Yeah, bro. Go ahead. Go ahead, blood. <laughs> this is why we do a health only challenge run. <laughs> How do I fuck the t <laughs> Look at my health bar. I'm still a half. <laughs> When you could just bait him into the big attack. Even when I fuck up the bait, he's still... He's st <laughs> it's a health only run. Look at what his grab attack did to me, bro. Well, I guess it's time for the character reveal. <laughs> Y'all might be able to tell a little bit through the little helmet, huh? Well, let's just say... With my NBA headband on and all. It's King James, baby. I'm LeBron James. <laughs> I'm LeBron James, baby. But you know, uh, my headband, it doesn't really stay on my forehead anymore, but I don't need to see anyway. So, you know, it's just going to be over my eyes a little bit. But yeah, you know, it's me. It's your boy LeBron, you know. Uh, I got a six leg parlay tonight, uh, and I'm betting on myself. <laughs> How you been, big fella? Long time no see. I'm LeBron James. Oh my god, and the jellyfish shield is over here too, isn't it? Come on, let me pick it up. Thank you, man. I might need Contagious Fury. I don't actually know what it does, but... I know I forgot about it. And I know that I could use it. Too bad I'm the fastest in the West, man. I'm LeBron James. Put me on a fast break in this trouble. I just fucked up. That dog evaded my fucking halberd hitboxes like no other. But he's dead. So. When it's a health only run, I mean, you, you do get some extra privileges. You know what? It does absolutely break every NPC. And I shouldn't have had any reason to think otherwise. Goodbye. No, that's a lot of damage. Alright, 
Why was she invisible, bro? God. Yes. Thank you, Ronnie. Oh, hey, no, she's talking to Ronnie. Thank you, Ronaldo. You were a little bit less of a nuisance. But you're still a nuisance. And I'm not. Because I'm LeBron James. LeBron James versus Altus Plateau. That ain't even a challenge, baby. Come on now. There's just simply no reason for me to slow down. I just killed the Reduvia Imp, as we call him in the industry. And really, I spinning striked him to death in all of 10 seconds. And that's what I plan to do. So big patches up here. So. Am I though? Am I really? All right, time for everybody's favorite part of the video where I uh, end up beating a bunch of bosses <laughs> when I'm not actually recording and then just cut up some clips of it. So uh, usually happens around this part of the game too, you know, not always intended, but we did do everybody's favorite kill, or should I say second favorite kill of the Draconic Tree Sentinel where you just poison missed that man to death. Uh, some of you may know you can also stagger him off a cliff, but that takes some uh, extra setup, which I don't actually know how to do. And then it was off to the gold free fight, and uh, usually I end up getting this fight in the first couple of tries anyway, you know, not the craziest fight, he gives a lot of great openings. But I actually did want to fight a couple other things before I went to fight more Got. And you can see in this Radon fight right here, I got hit by his Beyblade attack, point blank range, barely survived. You see I'm out of health flasks, um, or actually no, I have one here, but I think I did get hit again. Yeah, so out of health flasks, but the point was going to be to beat Radon and Mimic tier to get the silver tier mask because the Vagabond starts with like no arcane. And I wanted to be able to cast the Rotten Breath spell for Morgoth. It makes him a lot more consistent. So had to barely survive or done. Used every health flask I had. But we ended up getting it done. And that obviously unlocks the underground. Um, but yeah. So it was straight to Mimic tier. You know. Took off all the armor and weapons. Equipped the Halberd with spinning strikes. And got to work. Uh, you guys have already seen what this blasphemous skill right here does to NPCs. And this one was no different. I mean, just look at that shit. He just gets staggered every time. And really, there's only one way to describe this. No, that's a lot of damage. So, anyways, I'll just sit in there, right? And I seen that I'm driving past Chick fil A. Now, was I planning to stop at this Chick fil A originally? Hell no. But did I stop at that damn Chick fil A? Yes, sir. Boom. Boom, poke him, boom, boom. Oh, he hit me, shit. Now we back up. Now we back up, I need my FP. In fact, I'm gonna stick with the FP. We can bait his jumping attack here, though. You know, who, who doesn't like some free damage? Now what we're gonna wanna do. <sighs> now we just... And now that he's rotted, I can go ahead and uh, do that. And eventually I'll have figured out enough. Jesus, fuck! No. Fuck it. Beautiful. Now hopefully I can just kill him from here. 
Yeah, you might be cooked, buddy. Oh, it dodged early again. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, bro. Are we serious? He just one cycled my 67 vigor. Please, 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 please kill. Thank you, bro. <laughs> that was a lucky-ass stagger. You see, uh, that was my ugliest fight against this guy. Fucked up the rot, didn't get the frost proc, and we still won, so I don't really know. All I know is that that has to be the one where he dies. Maybe I'll show the clean phase one and cut to this, like I did with Renala. You know, Renala took two attempts. It's probably in the video. Listen, fucking raisin boy, you almost had me. Maybe with a little bit better effort, you know, a little bit better poise, you could have had it. He might be on horse, but I got the moves, baby. Can't explain it. No, I can't. Mm -hmm. Not to him. <laughs> Damn, that was crazy. Or, not, not, not like that, but <laughs> not general, like that. Okay. But especially <laughs> to someone like him. <laughs> okay, you got double <laughs> down. Work. <laughs> you can get double down. On or, but I mean, like, no, not, but like. Okay, shut your ass. Dude, <laughs> no. They got, they, they got the XP. You might as well quit while you're ahead, man. I didn't mean like him. I really just meant like like him. Yeah. <laughs> not him. Yeah. Him. The hardest shot in NBA, I mean, not NBA, but in basketball, is a wide open layup, though. Facts. <laughs> no, nah, it depends. The real, the real hardest shot is the little, the little five foot jumper in the corner. <laughs> yeah, that's air ball, air trip. Five out of five foot corner is crazy. That predicament that is like damn. Time. <laughs> like, <laughs> should I should I take a dribble and just lay this up? Should I take a floater or should I actually just commit to this five foot jumper? <laughs> but I know well, if I commit to it, it's missing. <laughs> Got to take that risk, man. Hey, like, who's that? Who's that kid behind that? Follow y'all said. Oh, you know what to do, baby. Mm -hmm. And then I said, <laughs> and then she said, where your, she was like, where your pants at?
Now you're just being a lying tramp. Huh. A lying tramp? Huh. A lying tramp is all he is. All he ever be. You need to use the word tramp. <laughs> yeah, little hoochie mama. Dude. <laughs> Are we serious? <laughs> oh shit. I'm having fun, man. Aren't you? I guess. So I open a tic I open a ticky tucker, right? I guess. Nigga got the vocabulary of an old head. <laughs> Okay, so you open one of them Tic Tacs? That's what I'm saying. I don't want no Tic Tacs. Right, first off, let me install my Naruto to Baruto, man. I heard it's finally, I heard it's finally up. But I gave you $60, I might as well make use of it. Are you about to uh, reinstall that thing? God, I'm about to. Good, because it never left the box for me. Let's go. I've been, mm -hmm. I've been training. Derek, I just <laughs> killed I just killed your arch nemesis. Oh, oh Malachi. Just dropped them off. It took me about six attempts though. Can't even lie. <laughs> hey, if I told you Gideon is already dead, would you be surprised? No, he's trash. <laughs> and, you, and you need help. Nah, because the, the weapon skill I'm using has a delay, so he rolls as soon as I click the button, and then he just gets murked by it anyway. Yeah. No, that's a lot of death! I'm walking. You see the other, you see the whole tree is on fire. Oh, who put the tree on fire like that? Oh my god, how do I? It was my boot thing. Oh god, it was. He betrayed me. No. Not like this. Damn it! Where you at, Lenny? In the fucking boss. <laughs> Go ahead and die, boy. I think I'm gonna win, actually. That's the plan, at least. Okay, so we we have no use for your gun. I don't know about all that. All I heard is need money. You don't need me because I'm so rat. And I agree with that statement. There we go. Now, I, now, fuck. Well, I died. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'll hit you with the cracker slammer like that. <laughs> Dude, I forgot it had a second thing to dodge. And I was just gonna run out of there and heal and win, and now I'm dead. That's what they said through the grapevine. And you know what they say everything hurt through the grapevine is truth. Yeah, they do. If say it was that. a lot, if it was a lie, they say it wouldn't make it to the vine. The vine era. That's what I'm saying. Ugh. It might be time for E Money to take his great nap. And he was like, he she walked with like ten. She walked with like two minutes. I was like, I was like, what's up? He was like, what's up? And I was like, I was chilling. And he's like. How old is he? Like, what class you in? Like, senior? And I was like, yeah. He's like, he was like, you know what you gonna do after school? I was like, he, I knew when he popped that question. I said, ah, shit, here we go, <laughs> here we go. And then I said, no, nah, I don't know yet. All I see bro do is stand up. He said, hey, and just handed me the card. He's like, think about it. Call me. I said, I got you. 
He <laughs> started cheesing. I was like, I was like, I, I was like, uh, and I was like, huh? I see. Ordinarily, I probably would do this, but when you got a bum nigga like me that don't know how to swim, there's no point <laughs> to commit. I got a chance to swim, it? And I was like. If I let you niggas teach me, y'all gonna teach me I put my life in danger. Throw that nigga in the ocean. See if he, see if he got flight for flight. If he drowns, he was never good enough. That's how y'all gonna train me. If he drowns, he wasn't good enough. He was meant to die. <laughs> That's literally how y'all gonna toss you in. Like, think about it, think about it, think about it, think about it. You're 16. <laughs> yeah, yeah, think about it. When you're 16, you go. So 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. You get out when you're 21. Because you do five. You see, you get out early, so you still young. We go now, we not getting out to like, cause think about it now. If we go right now, what is blood yapping about, dude? <clears throat> I think it's time to finish this run. All right, lock in. I just said I didn't know it had a follow up. He does it again, and I still fucked it up. All right, you're dead. Why is he not dead? Why is he not dead, bro? Look at his health bar. It's over. It's over. Yeah. I knew it, bro. I need at least four health flasks to Elden Beast. I have to be able to tank Elden Stars. Alright, decent start here. Let's see. Boom. 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 Poke him. Boom. Ice Spear. No stagger because they don't like me. Uh, big Lightning Bolt. Alright. Boom. Ice Spear. Boom. 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 Poke. Or just kill me. Alright. Out of FP. W frostbite, holy crap. Big ring. Shit, I fucked up my uh, my discovering where where he's gonna spawn at. But that's okay. Should be around here. Shoot! 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 W melee. He still hasn't done it. He still hasn't done it. I think I skipped it with a stagger. Hold on, this should be it. Cause he's gonna he's gonna fall again very soon. Melee, beautiful. Let's get some pokes in. Oh my god. Boom and. Finish him off with the repast! 
Oh my god, not only was it a clean kill, we must have staggered him out of Elden Stars. Wow. Let's go. That is crispy right there. Cri probably the crispiest Elden Beast fight ever of my career. <laughs> uh, the question is, should I sit on the throne right now? Oh my gosh, I always forget there's a grace in here. Anthony, what you know about Pan Zero? The part time hero? Oh my god, my brother of mine. He's dirty. He's dirty. just said the part time hero. I ain't know the bro, name. What more I gotta say? Pan Zero. I never <laughs> seen no, bro. I only you caught, I only caught I gotta the say? middle of the episodes. Oh, I only caught god. middle episodes. I've Nigga never seen the beginning bro. of the single Pan Zero episode. <laughs> Say the full I've never name, seen it. Pen Zero, the part-time hero. Come on, now. I've it's never tough. seen a full Pen Zero episode. But yeah, I, get, I gotta. I, I catch it when I wake up in the morning, bro. Cause that, yeah. that stuff would come on early. It came on like right before sometimes. school. It came. It literally came on at like no Pen Zero airtime was garbage. Oh, big big bomb. That actually did not do as much as I thought. A second frostbite. <laughs> second frostbite is kind of crazy. Wow. Hardest boss fight of my career right there. We'll see if this goes horribly wrong or not. I mean, my damage wasn't terrible. I would just have to live a long time and actually learn a move that I've never learned before. But You never know. Well, when I can get attacks off, I can do some good things. Oh my god. Good job, Rollo. Damn. <laughs> oh my god. God damn, bro. God damn. Fire's just everywhere. Alright, well that could be doable with uh, with Rolo cooking up for first phase, but he still gets his health back even with the purifying tier, so. Eventually. Moog has been killed. And because of that, the challenge is officially over. So now I can put these well deserved levels into my favorite stat strength. So that is going to wrap up this run and this video. Please let me know down below in the comments if you guys want to see more challenge runs. You know, I got a couple more ideas for um, Elden Ring. There's one that me and Derek are actually planning to do where we're going to try to beat the game as fast as possible. But these are technically uh, a lot different from my normal uploads. There's still some of our normal antics, uh, essentially just, you know, highlight reels of the recordings. But definitely a different style of upload. But yeah, this one was a really fun one, you know. But I know why we're all really here. We want to see LeBron James on the throne, you know. King James as he's also known. So there's that for everybody who was waiting for that final cutscene. But until next time, y'all, drop a like, sub up if you're new. I'm out.
Zero losses on my record, Scotty Pippen in the final. BR1 and two on wax, come and get a vinyl. Every time I throw a touchdown, that bitch is spiral. Treat these hoes like water bottles, how they get recycled. I've been traveling all week, this my sixth ride. Bitch hit five, my shoes got blew off. Ride with that, let's have the shoot off. That one shit to turn your TT into Rudolph. I know you read the shirt.